We're on top of Lone Peak. We are, um, we've, we're excavating for the, the upper foundation station and the tower for the Big Sky Tram. It's a cool project. There's a lot of challenges. It varies tremendously. So trying to figure out where the rock is, what we've got to do to get it there, and then getting access down there has been a challenge. But we've, we've been able to do it, and it's, it's also a pretty beautiful place to work. So that helps kind of with the challenges. We're done blasting up top. We had to blast out that, that front wall, and then we had to blast out for the two bollards. The bollards sit about eight feet below where the, the top of the mountain is, and then we'll pour a concrete slab on top of that. The top of the slab will be within a foot of where the top of the original summit was. We're drilling the blast holes down at the tower right now. That'll be a mid-span. It's about 800 feet down from the top to clear over the ridge line. Well, we're drilling those horizontally. There's three footings at the tower. There's two main supports and then one lateral support that go in down there. That drill that they're using right now, it's a wagon drill. It's a pretty specialized piece of equipment. They're custom rig. I'm getting ready to install the piles here. They're micro piles, so they're um, seven and five eighths piles. Be going in 45 to 50 feet, have load of 270,000 pounds. They'll support the structure up top, and then there'll be 18 piles and two tiebacks that'll hold up the tower. I don't think the mountain will look any different if you're looking at it from the bottom. It looks different right now, but when we're all said and done, I think you won't be able to really tell that there's been any significant change up here. The uh, goal by the end of the summer, and hopefully early fall, will be that we've got all the concrete done and next summer they come out and set the tram.